things weren't going very well. We'd landed somewhere, from the looks of it, prehistoric. I was slightly concerned when Bentley broke out the dinosaur repellent, but that was the least of my worries. The crash landing had damaged the van, so the time machine wasn't working properly. Not only was traveling back to Paris impossible, but we couldn't even raise Dimitri on the transceiver. Also, we still had no idea how the Paradox had managed to develop his own time machine. And that was a scary thought. Carmelita was still really hot about things. I just wanted a chance to explain, to tell her how sorry I was for getting her mixed up in all of this. Before we had a chance to talk, she stormed off in a rage. I tried going after her, but I figured that wasn't the best idea. Our conversation would have to wait, at least until she holstered that pistol. We decided the first order of business was figuring out where and when we were. And then, how we were going to repair the van. Otherwise, we'd have to get used to living in a cave, permanently. Alrighty, to the thief net! We're in a brand new area, there might be some new stuff. Uh, although, saying that, it doesn't look like there is. Oh, that's interesting. Fair enough. Um, right, well, I'm looking forward to this, because this, in theory, won't work like a normal world. There isn't a villain to scope out. <laughs> we're just trapped here, so I don't know what we're going to be doing. I'm guessing, conveniently, someone is here for the wrong reasons, but, uh... I, I guess we'll, uh, we'll we'll see how that manifests itself. I'm I'm intrigued. But uh, yeah, I mean, hey, Ice World, Ice World, Gunga. Ten thousand BC. I see. That's yeah, that's quite a long time ago. Yeah, this is cool. Wow. Yeah, this place is really pretty. Okay. Well, where is it we're going anyway? That way. Okay, we'll, we'll head on over. Why well, not the music as well? <laughs> it's not what I expected, but also it's very fitting, so. Oh, wait, do I have to be on top of it? Oh, how do I do that? A fine question. It's a good job, ooh, all. I was say it's a good job even back then they had pockets. Did, would they have had words? <laughs> like. Oh, well, well, we'll buy it. Okay, so we need to get to the top of the nest. Okay, I see what we're doing. So I can get to that from the top of here, I think. I guess we're about to find out if that is indeed true. Ooh, okay, maybe not. Yeah, this music's awesome. Here we go. Bad news just got worse, Sly. Looks like a couple of pieces of the time drive broke off in that crash landing. I need you to track down the missing components ASAP. Fortunately, the advanced trajectory management processor is still functional, so I was able to calculate their most likely positions. Unfortunately, they seem to have landed in some dangerous terrain. The temporal sprocket appears to have fallen close to some pterodactyl nests. And I'm afraid one of these prehistoric penguins might have gotten its flippers on the gravity encabulator. Oh, they may look cute, but those little devils are nasty. This isn't going to be a simple pickup slide. Get some photos of their precise locations, and I'll analyze them to formulate a plan. But watch your back. I don't think we're the first guests at this party. See the structure on that mountain? It appears to be some kind of conveyor belt system. Definitely not Ice Age technology. Get a picture of that machinery, too. I smell a rat. Or possibly something even worse. Interesting. Bentley, uh, have you heard anything from Carmelita? Sorry, Sly. I think maybe she just needs to cool off. For what it's worth, I'm just as worried about Penelope. I know, pal. And we're gonna get her back. I promise. 
it's interesting how like they're just like just scope out where the the item may be as opposed to actually just get it <laughs> but I'm guessing you've seen me <laughs> I'm gonna get a bottle so do I just take a picture of this cave is that what we're doing kinda I mean there was a penguin there oh there you are Take a picture of the penguin and then fear it, and that's it. <laughs> Perfect, old fly. Oh. Okay, we'll work on that. Those little guys don't look so bad to me. No, they look super cute. Okay, you died in one hit. What's the deal? Why does he think they're so threatening when they can die so easily? I'm intrigued and concerned. Yeah, they run away from me as well. Well, yes, we are not the only ones here. Interesting indeed. I guess we'll see what the dealio is with that. Gimme. Gimme. Yay! Lovely. Good job, everyone. And by everyone, I mean me. I, I'm, I'm the only one playing, I'm the only one here, so, so I, all in all, I did amazing, let's, let's just all agree, <laughs> then, no. um, so, oh, you've got something good, though, you've got something important on you, I want it, I like that you can't see me somehow, it's a Star Trek emblem, wow, so, we're trying to p take a picture of what exactly? Something on the other side of that. Okay, how do I get on the other side? Oh, this might help. Hmm, something tells me you might be a problem. <laughs> oh, can I take a picture of it from here? Probably, yeah. Aha! There's the conveyor! Cool. Okay, that conveyor belt does not belong here. The question is, what is it being used for? Can I not take a picture of this? Like... Oh, yes, no, I can. I totally can. Sweet. Awesome. Very nice, Sly. Getting a shot of that pterodactyl took some skill. Yeah. It, it was handy. Let's come back when I don't look so appetizing. Sly, I'm taking something up. Look for a building that resembles an arena, and let's take a closer look. My thermal vision an is arena. up a lot of activity there. You got it, pal. Can I take a picture of it from here? I cannot, and that is okay. Um, I have seen a mask up there. I'm trying to work out how I would get to that. I'm not seeing anything specific. Oh. There's like a... Oh, that's a treasure, probably. I was going to say, there's like a cog or something. Yeah, that makes sense. Now, how would I get up there? That might be something I can't do. Since we're clearly going to meet a ancestor, they might be able to climb up that frozen waterfall. Looks like that might be the, the dealio with that. If, if I had to... If I had to guess... Oh... Come on, come on, Sly. Climb it. Yeah, I'm, I'm guessing that's that's what it would be. I could be wrong, but it would make sense. Ooh. Here we go. So you wanted me up here, right? Yeah, there we go. One, two, got a masterpiece for you. Yeah. Thought it was gonna say Bexy. Quite delighted it didn't, because that was an awful pun, but that's where I thought it was going. <laughs> Do I have to wait for him to turn around? I'm guessing so. Oh, apparently that was it. <laughs> okay, no way this guy dug that bling up around here. No, you're absolutely right, Sly. He definitely doesn't belong here. This whole place demands an investigation. Let's start by figuring out who we're dealing with here. Good 
job, Sly. Now head back to the hideout. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. So, we have arrived at a conveniently decent time period. <laughs> of all the places in time we could have shown up, we have arrived on the exact time, the exact week, that someone else is here. Because <laughs> let's, be, let's be real, but after this week they're probably going to go away. <laughs> the amount of convenience that is at play here is impressive. At the same time, it's a video game and I'm okay with it, so <laughs> that's that's fine. So, okay, it's not it's not quite the uh you know the, the different type of world that I thought maybe it could be. Because obviously we can uh we can take down this this bully. Whatever they're here to do. We seem to have found the mission. That was easy enough. Why we need to figure out what that bear is up to. That crack in the wall looks like the perfect entrance. But you'd better keep a low profile until we know what's going on. I hear you, pal. Fair enough. I can make my way in there, no problem. Yeah, I think I'll probably end up just backtracking through the uh, bottles and and masks and whatnot. Uh, obviously if I see one, I'll go for it. Um, but I'm not going to hunt for them until the very end and we'll do a bunch of videos of just cleaning up. Because that seems like the easiest way of doing it. Um, I say easy. I wouldn't say it's exactly easy. You, you know what I mean. It's... It'll take time, but it is worth it. Still no word from Lair Korea. of the Bear. That is a good name for a mission. <laughs> hmm, interesting. Goopy. I can't tell if the uh, explosion is going to. Uh, oh, hello. Uh, yeah, I can't tell if the explosion is going to. Like hit me when I'm on the icicles. Oh wow. Jesus, this is the mother load of coins. Wow. Hello. What have we here? Heaven? Is that what this is? It, it feels like it currently. I know. I heard when Joe messed up, the boss turned him into a coat for that Le Paradox guy. Yeah, that Le Paradox is bad news. I heard last time he was here, he yanked this one guy's tusks, just for fun! Ouch. Yeah, good luck talking to the ladies without any tusks. <laughs> Watch yourself, Sly, and don't alert the guards! I don't know why, I wasn't going to. I was planning to try and keep a very low profile, because they are very strong, so... Yeah, the music in this this chapter is brilliant. Where's it exactly I'm going? You know what? I'm not 100% sure. Ah, oh, I didn't mean. Oh, I didn't think you were gonna follow that. To ah, damn it. Okay, never mind. If I just take you out, out of curiosity, wow, okay, so don't even touch them, gotcha, 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 okay, I see what we're doing. Watch yourself, Fly, and don't alert the guards! I hear you, pal. Yeah, but where do I go? The only place I haven't really checked is way over here. But no, this looks like a dead end. I mean, it's obviously the door. Was, oh, can I go in? No. Well, there's this right here, but I don't understand. No, I don't understand. What do you want from me? Oh, I can climb this. Oh, okay. Oh, that's my bad. Yeah, fair enough. 
it just didn't look like he climbed this. I was very wrong. Oh, these give you so many coins. I love it. Um, yeah, no, I just I didn't realize. Oh, this is cool. Whoa, whoa, what, whoa, whoa, Sly, what are you doing, man? <laughs> it's nice to know that even that is consistent across games. Different, de different developers, same issues with grabbing onto stuff. Sly just doesn't like to grab the nearest thing sometimes. Every single one of these games has had that problem. There we go. That's more like it. This place is awesome. Wow. I'm glad I'm not that poor guy. What's weird is that he looks kind of familiar. Wait. Holy missing link. Sly, that's a prehistoric raccoon. I wonder if he could be... My ancestor? It's a distinct possibility. Let's help him out. Sly, I have an idea. But you need to get that saber tooth tiger skin. And just don't let the guards see you. I'm on it, Bentley. One tiger skin coming up. So that's my costume for this world. Interesting. Well, look who's at the party. Why am I not surprised he's part of this? Oh. <laughs> that Doesn't it look almost like a cane? Sly, you need to hurry. I like how I didn't get caught. I'm honestly unsure how I didn't get caught, but I like how I didn't. I think you ah, cool. Here, Sly. Nice. So, if you didn't have the paraglider, I'm guessing it wouldn't let you even start the mission, right? That would make sense. I'm honestly surprised they... Oh, whoops. Yeah, I'm surprised they didn't just give it to you. Like, it only cost a hundred. There wouldn't have been any, like, problem in just how I get giving it to you from the first second. This guy's painting is not improving my opinion of him. Forget about the art. See that key? I bet it unlocks that door. Right. Time for some real art. The art of pickpocketing. I mean... Van Gogh ain't got nothing on me. It's not bad. Hold that big fool still. Run, run, run. Lair door key, lovely you stuff. Go grab that tiger skin, fly. Yeah, that was actually quite easy. <laughs> That's a cool way to open a door, though. That tiger skin. Okay, here it is. Should I destroy everything? I mean, I kind of want to. It would be helpful for my own personal gain. Ah! Oh, that's a new one, right? I think, yeah. Ultimate Sly. Sly is the darkest knight in this costume. Cloaking shadow, he is tireless force of justice and picking pockets. Batman? <laughs> Batman costume? Or, or similar kind of thing? Whoa! Was rad. Oh, okay, that's pretty good. I quite like it. My color, but I'll make it work. Way to go, Sly! Now get going. Okay, sweet. Does that say play dead? Amazing. Wow. So it's basically the wow. Yeah, it's basically the ability we had as our ancestor in the first world, but I guess slightly differently. Pretty cool. I'm on board. Kill. That's broken as hell. Why would I need to play dead when I can just annihilate everything? Perfect, Sly. Hmm. 
Uh, yes. I don't know what it wants from me here, actually. Yeah, I just get on this. Fair enough. That is very, very cool. Like, I, I don't know what I was expecting. <laughs> it wasn't that. <laughs> so... It's amazing! You got it, fly! Just so overpowered. Oh no, oh no, I'm I'm a dead man. Okay. I feel like that wasn't my fault. But Oh well, what can you do? Yes, I have experienced this already. Don't make it quick with that stick. The frizz don't play. I ain't got all day. Now that's what I'm talking about. Here's the cheese. Now I want to talk to your boss about my good. The guards on those pedestals are the ones restraining him, Fly. Take them out, and he should be free. Looks easy enough. Be careful, Sly. If you're caught, you'll never get it out of there. This is the perfect situation for your cyclone pounce. Yeah, I'd work that out. First costume, then kill. Yeah, this is glorious. <laughs> Absolutely glorious. Yeah, there's a small delay on when you can do it. That makes sense. I think it's the uh, the meter at the top is when you're allowed to do it. But apart from that, it's uh, pretty effective. And we win! Good game, good game. <laughs> see the resemblance, but I'll take your word for it, Bentley. Hey, big guy, what do you say we get out of here? Well, no, we've never met, but a reliable source tells me we're distantly related. I'm not sure what to say. Um, it, it's truly amazing to meet you. Uh, what's your name? Um, my name's Sly. Sly Cooper. What's yours? Right. How about I just call you Bob? He's right, Sly. You two should get out of there before more guards show up. Come on, follow me. Um, okay, I guess we'll do it your way. 